What's going on guys, I'm Super Rebel and today I just wanted to sit down and talk to you guys about the whole earning money from YouTube and PewDiePie money situation that has been going everywhere over the internet over the last couple of days. Now, I asked you guys on Instagram and Twitter if you like my thoughts on this and stuff and there was quite a lot of you guys that wanted me to do this and on that note, if you don't already follow me on Instagram, please go ahead and follow me. I've only just started to use it, I'll link it in the description below. A lot of you guys have been following me over there over the last day or so and I really do appreciate that so if you could follow me that'd be great and if you agree with what I have to say in the video go ahead and drop a like or if you completely disagree with what I have to say go ahead and dislike it you can also leave your thoughts with me in the comment section below as it is one of those videos that is just gonna be full of opinions so let's just jump right into it so First of all, if you aren't already aware, PewDiePie did make $7 million in 2014. Now, that is just an insane number. That is absolutely crazy. And this is where people, I guess, are starting to cry about the whole situation and start moaning and hating on him, saying that he doesn't deserve to earn that much money, etc, etc. And this is actually the annoying part, because if you are in a situation like PewDiePie or any situation where someone was like, Go ahead, play video games, do what you love, and we'll pay you a million dollars, or ten thousand dollars, or whatever it is. Even if it's like fifty dollars, are you telling me you actually will not go have fun, play video games, and then take the money? That is the part that people don't understand. Everyone's like, oh, PewDiePie don't deserve to make that much money, etc, etc. But it's like them, I'm sure they play video games, and like I gave you the example, if someone was to pay them doing that, are you telling me they're not gonna do that? No, of course, they would definitely go ahead and take that offer and it doesn't make you a money whore if you do that. And now this is going on to the entire situation about earning money from YouTube in general. Now, it is a cool thing, but it always brings out those people that start to call you a sellout, a money whore, etc, etc. And it's just absolutely ridiculous. Like, come on, seriously? Now here's the definition of a sellout. So, if you are a sellout, that means where you have produced quality videos or anything, products, whatever it may be, and then you get to a stage where companies start asking you to promote shitty products or apps or, or games or whatever it could possibly be and then you go ahead and take that opportunity that is when you do become a sellout now if someone offers you to play their video game or their app or review their product that you personally think it's cool and you are going to get paid for it that does not make you a sellout because you enjoy whatever it is they are giving you to review play or I guess just where you never know there are so many different like sponsors and stuff all over YouTube. Now, I don't know PewDiePie in person, I've never ever spoke to him, but I do know people that know him, and just from that and watching his videos, you can tell he is a really humble guy, and if you just go to his channel, this is a dude with 40 million subscribers almost, and he uploads every single day. Now, that is dedication, and that just shows that he loves what he's doing, so I don't think it's fair that people are hating on him, and if you compare him to other YouTubers, and I'm not going to say any names but there are people with like 10 million subscribers 5 million subscribers or just about hit a million and then they start moving on to other stuff like they stop uploading they realize they're making a lot of money then they start doing stuff in real life and just completely forget about YouTube and basically the people that help them get there that is what I find wrong but like I said PewDiePie is someone who has continued to do the same thing for I believe it is it four years or even more I'm not too sure but this dude has just kept on grinding, he's still doing it, and making videos isn't something easy to do, although you're having a lot of fun doing it, it's still not easy, and this is again where a lot of people start to misunderstand things, because you gotta record the footage, and like PewDiePie in this instance, you gotta record your voice, your face, then you gotta edit it, do thumbnails and all that stuff, and talking from my own experience, that stuff can take up to 10 hours or even more, and it might sound crazy, but for someone like PewDiePie who has to edit all that stuff including his face and then the cuts and all that stuff, audio, music, effects and everything. That takes a lot of time. So before you are about to hate on a YouTuber, call them a sellout or whatever you want to call them. 
Just think what they're doing. They're entertaining their fans, they're doing what they love, and they're making some sort of income from it. And another good thing that I like about PewDiePie is he doesn't brag. He doesn't show off what he's got. Now this is a guy that I said at the beginning of the video made $7 million last year. But you don't see him making videos about my new house, my new car, etc, etc. You do not see this stuff from him. And this is where I have so much respect for him. He just does not brag about anything. Compared to other YouTubers, my new car is like an all chromed out Ferrari and stuff like that. This is a dude that probably can't afford that. He can go and buy that right now and I'm sure he has a really nice house and a really nice car but again you do not see him bragging about it. And it's just good. He's a really good YouTuber in my opinion. Personally I don't watch him a lot but I do watch him on a I guess monthly basis here and there maybe once every two months or something like that. He's not a YouTuber that I watch every single day but I do enjoy his videos and you can just instantly see that he does spend a lot of time on what he does. And don't forget guys buying products to make your videos better, buying a mic, buying a camera, all that stuff adds up. So if you are someone who is moaning about PewDiePie earning money from YouTube, just stop it. Seriously, it's absolutely fucking ridiculous. How much this dude makes or any YouTuber in general is none of your business. It doesn't affect you in real life in any shape or form, so there is no real reason to bitch about it. But that about wraps up the video. I just really wanted to kind of get my thoughts out there about the entire earning money from YouTube situation. Just sit down and think if you was in that position, would you take it or would you not? But I'll catch you guys in the next video. But till then, adios amigos.